everybody, Martin the Flicker Feathers again today. I'm tying a small black snow fly. Quite a simple wee pattern but very effective. As always, I'll put a materials list in the description, along with a link to the Patreon page. If you want to support the channel, get access to the members only content and be entered into the giveaways. So I've got my hook in my vise, this is a size 18 TMCO 100 but um, tie these up. I mean you can adjust the size to suit the stonefly where you live um, 14's down to about a 20 probably for most folk I would say for these little patterns and I've just run on some black Uni a hot. I'm going to put a wee bit of dubbing on. It's just black, super fine. Don't want very much. Okay. Slide that up, and then I'll just continue wrapping. I've got a few miller thread to take me right back to I'm in line with the the barb. And then I'm just going to wrap this dubbing up. Create a nice slim tight dubbed body. And come back a wee bit, make a wee taper. Like that. Wing is just a single small CDC feather. And I'm just using natural. You can also tie them like with a wonder wing and all that, but most of the time this is just as effective. I don't think the fish care at all really. A couple of light turns, just got to pull this in until the CDC is just about in line, just maybe slightly longer than the back of the hook. A couple of turns to lock it in. And that gives you a nice wee low flat wing. I mean if you really want to put it in and flatten it and narrow it, you can sort of grab it and crease it a wee bit. Just hold it tight, then push forward. That will crease really and really flatten and tighten the wing in. So you've got like a wee narrow shape like that. And then the hackle is just, I'm just using a grizzly hackle. And I would say. You don't need too much. Just take that with my hackle plier. There's one, two, and it depends on the hackle and what have you. Oops, size of the fly, obviously, but I'm only one, two, that's plenty. Is that about three and a half tons or something? Then I'll trim that away. Whip finish. Thread. And you can apply a wee bit of varnish to the head. And I just come in with my brush onto the eye and let that sort of soak up onto the thread. That way it doesn't touch your hackle. Clean the eye out. And there's your wee black stone fly. You can trim the hackle underneath, but I usually wait until I'm on the river. Um, sometimes that wee bit of extra hackle is useful. 
tie them black, tie them dark brown, look for your February reds and stuff. Um, good wee pattern. Also works in a midge hatch. Well worth sticking these in your box. So I hope that was useful. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please uh, give me a thumbs up below, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell button so you get notified of the new videos. Hit guys. Bye.